coming here to encourage us. And uh, of course, most importantly, I want to thank Shamita for uh, you know obliging to this uh, request of mine to support me. And uh, of course, this is my second time at uh, LFW. And um, you know, it's a great experience always to be here because they are so encouraging of new talent and people who are not even from this genre. And uh, for me, I think being here more than anything is always like welcoming into the new world for tomorrow. And uh, of course, like you can see, she looks gorgeous and I'm sure everybody's gonna agree to that. And um, yes, yeah, so my uh, collection this time is called Urban Quaint. And uh, it is of course with a lot of handlooms, like how I always worked, because we support a lot of weavers. And um, um, we just try to add a little bit of, you know, the new gen touch to it. So it is more, uh, uh, you know, bridal and wearable and very fresh colors. We've done a lot of pinks, we've done a lot of yellows and greens, because of course it's gonna be the festive season next. So I hope this time also, like last time, the world is gonna, you know, embrace us and the collection. And uh, yeah, I think, that's what the collection is about. <laughs> Everyone, uh, for starters, I just want to wish uh, uh, Divya all the very best, even for the future. Um, I'm someone who likes to encourage, you know, new, uh, not new, but young designers, young talent. And uh, her collection this time is absolutely beautiful. The colors, the designs, so feminine, so pretty. And I feel really pretty beautiful wearing your outfit today. So thank you. Thank you so much. Um, like you can see, you know what, uh, since it's bridal, it's not like we could do way too much out of the box because we want the brides to be happy and our Indian outfits in themselves, you know, whatever silhouettes we wear, be it a sari or lehenga, I think is the most amazing outfits according to me. Even though I've studied Western fashion, I ultimately ended up doing Indian is only because I love the silhouettes and how feminine, you know, it, it just ultimately makes you look. and. Oh my God, she's looking like a doll right now. So I'm, I'm, you know, it's very difficult for me to concentrate on, you know, looking somewhere else, not her outfit. <laughs> the bridal season uh, this time, I haven't, uh, you know, gone too dark because now obviously it's fall winter. It is very expected that, you know, designers come up with a lot of dark colors, you know, deep colors and stuff like that. But just to cut away from a little bit of that, we've moved on to the uh, pastel palette. And um, of course, pinks is some, uh, some color that I don't think any bride will not have in her wedding trousseau. So pink is the standard color that we've used, of course. And yellows and greens, I've used a lot of ikkat weave, so which you will be seeing in my collection that we are launching now at LFW Apartment. So there are a lot of hand looms, basically. It's all ikkat weave, and I'm from Telangana slash Andhra Pradesh. So ikkat is our weave, Pochumpali. So I've tried to incorporate that into the fashion world. Um. I don't know, I've never been someone who's really uh, fussed too much about what's in today, what's not. I wear something that's comfortable for me, um, something that I believe looks nice on me. And I guess um, when you end up shopping, you always end up buying stuff that is in because it's a new collection that you shop anyway, right? So you kind of keep up with the new trend. But like I said, I mean, my style is fairly simple. I, I think it's important to wear something that you're comfortable in, in in and not just blindly follow trends. That's something that, I don't know, I've always done. I always keep adding shoes uh, <laughs> because I'm really uh, a fond of bags and shoes. I think every girl is. Um, I can't think of any particular thing that I've added to my uh, wardrobe. Yeah, okay, <laughs> this new beautiful pretty pink outfit, one of my favorite colors. Yes, uh, see, we, I majorly use, uh, I said I majorly use handlooms, that's why, you know, uh, I would say about 80% of my entire outfit is usually a handloom. Uh, of course, the dupattas, because, you know, they're in net or they're in organza, which are very, uh, very flimsy, like very feminine sort of fabric, just to give that entire feel to it. But um, the rossels that we use or, uh, you know, the ikkat rossels that we use or ikkats in general we use, everything is hand woven. It's not even a hand, it's not a power loom also. It's completely hand loom. So currently we are, you know, because this art of hand loom I think is, uh, you know, comparatively dying because, you know, a lot of people are moving to power loom because it's more simpler and it's more obviously economical and things like that. But just to keep that alive and that is the primary reason why I even started Indian fashion. So I'm hoping to take it forward from there. Um, dancing is a passion, of course. Um, so is acting. Uh, I think I've, I've not really been given a chance to explore 
uh, acting that much, unfortunately. I, I hope to do that in the near future. Um, dancing is, is something uh, that's fun for me. It takes me to a different world. It keeps me really happy. I'll just put it that way. The entire nation is so proud that this time it's the women who've actually brought back the medals and, you know, um, we're just so proud and happy. I mean, that's all I can say. And I just hope more women are encouraged, uh, you know, um, to do better. I mean, they're given better facilities to train and all of that, you know, for the Olympics next time. Um, and yeah, and encouraged. That's all I can say. Thank you. Um, when was my first retro comeback? I mean, I, I really don't know. But because like I said, um, my palazzo pants and all, that's something I've been wearing since forever and even today. So like I said, I won't just blindly follow fashion because it's in today. Um, well, like I said, um, in ke jo, jo use of colors hai, the, the handloom, mm -hmm. um, you know, the entire collection is, is, is handloom, which I think is, is lovely. I love raw silk. Um, and even the work, itna bhar bhar ke puri outfit mein work nahi hai. It's easy to wear, it's comfortable, and it's just beautiful. Mm -hmm. And she's given me a pink outfit to wear, so I'm so happy. And it's just so pretty. Look at the outfit. <laughs> I'm very comfortable in it. Oh, good grief. I think just wear what you're comfortable in with the right attitude. Be confident uh, of who you are. It's as simple as that. And I think that for me is fashionable. Thank you guys.